Fans of Sinead O'Connor have been leaving gifts and notes outside the singer's former home as they prepare to say a final goodbye at her funeral today. Following her death in July, Sinead O'Connor's funeral will take place in her Irish hometown today. Following her death aged 56, fans of the late singer mourning her loss are already lining the streets and leaving gifts as they prepare to say a final goodbye. From 10.30 a.m. today, a funeral cortege will progress along the seafront in Bray, past. Sinead's former home, Montebello, the family of the late star have asked people who wish to say a last goodbye to stand along Bray Seafront in Co Wicklow as the cortege passes by before a private burial. The procession will begin at the harbour bar end of Strand Road and will continue past the home she lived in for 15 years. Following her death on July 26, fans have been leaving flowers and paying their respects at the house, which the singer sold in 2021. Ahead of her funeral, her family said, Sinead loved living in Bray and the people in it. With this procession, her family would like to acknowledge the outpouring of love for her from the people of Co-Wicklow and beyond, since she left. Last week, to go to another place, the Gardai have asked that people gather, if they would like to say a last goodbye to the singer, from 10.30 a.m. on Tuesday along the Bracey front. Amongst the gifts and flowers outside Sinead's former home. Heartfelt notes from fans have also been written in her memory, one mourner thanked the nothing compares to you singer for her activism and love for her fans, you were gentle with us, you tried to stay with us, thank you for helping us, part of it read, another handwritten note from a fan named Bridget read, thank you for your short special life, gone too soon, give your lovely son Shane a hug for me in heaven. Have a nice long rest with Shane, the message was referencing her second youngest child Shane, who died by suicide in January last.